What's up guys? Welcome to today's video and today we're talking about the three-headed rushing attack. We kind of gave you a little bit of a preview yesterday and some of the runs we're going to be using. But We have three runs. We're going to be using the strong power, the Hawks jet sweep, and the sh inside zone. And we're going to be using them out of three different formations that can all are very good at doing three specific different things. Okay, so basically what's, what we want to look at here, so we would come out in our wide trips week. Now we're going to have this as an audible, and this is why you need to be able to set audibles for this playbook. But we're going to have that Hawks jet sweep in there. You see we have Deshaun Jackson there. Now you see in this situation the defense is man aligned, and what what if like they show blitz here? So we're going to show a look here. This would be a look where we would uh, potentially want to really um, – this would be a look where we would really want to run this uh, play Hawks Jet Sweep. You see how they're all stacking the line. And now I'm just going to try to get the ball to Deshaun Jackson. He's going to motion in the backfield. And we're going to try to use the outside blocking on the edge of Jason Avant to get to the edge. Now, obviously, there I could pro probably would go in more of a strong power type run. Uh, but you get the idea. Now, what we can do off of this real quickly is. Um, we want to go to that pistol trips and I don't have the strong power so you're just going to audible to that pistol trips in the game mode because you're going to have your audible set but basically what we want to what we want to get out here is when they start to kind of give a little bit more of a balanced look and it looks like we have the numbers advantage to run the strong power to the right outside so something like this this is another look where they're a little bit weak to the left side or to the right side so we're going to use the strong power and we get outside and you see LaShawn Shady McCoy is going to go to the house and so that's the other run that we wanted that's the other run I wanted to show you it's pistol trips now the cool part is that when you audible from pistol trips to shotgun trio offset the audible is seamless so if they're trying to contain the edges and we just want to get them quick in the inside you see we can quickly audible over there and give the ball off to little Sean McCoy now what a lot of teams will start doing is as soon as they see you audible to that trio, they're going to start to run commit to the middle because they know they can't stop that run in this alignment. What we like to do in that circumstance is use the play action audible PA uh, dig here. And basically we're going to quick throw um, Jeremy Macklin's route when he cuts up field. Here we snap, we quick throw it up, pass lead up. You see Jeremy Macklin then roast the defender over the top. The play action is essential because when they run commit, they're going to get even more so sucked down. So we go through it, and, and this is just playing off of tendencies, but it's another avenue. Because you see, they'll audible down, and you audible down, and now they have a lot better of a shot at stopping that run. Okay? Because they know that there's no threat of an outside running play, but they don't realize that there is a threat of a play action play. So here that we go play action. And we get the quick throw out. We just got to get it out as fast as possible, try to get the ball out of our hands. But that's the whole, you know, mind game that we can play with this package is, you know, we go play action. And if we, you know, if they catch us, maybe, we, you know, we'll have to make our reads and everything like that. But that's how we use the three runs, guys. And I really want to emphasize the strong power is really effective. But don't overuse it. Only use these runs if they give you a look for it. That's the idea of the scheme, because if you just abuse one run all the game, eventually they're going to stop it. But if you mix in three of probably the best runs in the game going different directions, it really is very difficult to stop. And every now and then you can, you know, playmaker the pistol trips to the right, or I mean to the left, and, and try to work at that side as well. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much what I wanted to talk about today with the um, with the three-headed rushing attack, we truly—it's a true three-headed rushing attack where we're we're attacking right outside, left outside, and then also attacking the middle. Now we can also attack the middle out of the pistol trips if we want, because sometimes you'll see they'll start spreading out because they're facing the pistol trips. So you know something like this look we get, we can go right down to the pistol trips halfback dive and use the middle as well. So. But it's all the mentality of, you know, having the ability to go through d three different distinct formations that do three distinctive things very effectively. Trio offset's good for inside running. Pistol trip's good for outside running. And then the Hawks jet sweep is a good kind of uh, power run where you can get him to the edge and, and really get, uh, you know, a new face in the running game into Sean Jackson. 
but the beauty of this is that you, the seamless audibling and the speed of the offense really allows us to have a lot of flexibility with our running attack. So that's our three-headed rushing attack, guys. I'm going to say this offense should probably going to be running the ball uh, about 50, 50, probably maybe even 60% of the time. So be sure to master this video, and we'll see you tomorrow with the man beater.